I don't like to use the excuse, oh, sorry, I have a boyfriend when I'm rejecting a man because I want them to know it's really important to me that boyfriend or no boyfriend, I am rejecting you based on your own personal inferior merit and ugly face. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? So I think it's really important as women that we make that decision uh, collectively to specify that this rejection is coming from the heart. I mean it. All right, ladies, this is what I want to name a teaching moment, right? This is not a good idea. This will get you seriously hurt in some urban cities where you have a lot of young dans degenerate ass niggas they are very emotional because they didn't have masculine energy around them when they were kids when their brain was still forming and developing because of that they act out really irrational just like an emotional woman would because half of these guys were raised by single mothers so if you try this on them you are likely to get your head knocked in between the washer and dry because these guys cannot take the feeling uh, of feeling played of being disrespected y'all are the weak investors on average men are much stronger than women so do you really want to gamble with your health with your safety and your well-being please do not take this message and run with it as it sits today this video has 552k likes which means it got millions and millions of views do not do this lady it's unwise i just felt like if you and he nutted in you and he asked you to pay for the plan b he don't give a f about you. Oh my mama, I ain't never had to play for a pair and bleep. Oh my mama. No. No. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. No. 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 Hell no. 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 I refuse. No. No. You know what's crazy? These women are flexing in the most bizarre ways. This came off as if she was trying to flex. Man, I'm that dudes are always gonna pay for the plan b when it come to me why are you so proud to let us know that all of these dudes is skeeting in your virginia and, and shooting the club up why are you so excited to tell us this because now we know you are a fight it is what it is you got that loose virginia energy you know what i'm saying like bruh it does not make any sense you are over sexualizing yourself on a platform no guy's ever going to take you serious after this only a low self-esteem type of guy would take you serious you're going into the category designated for the legs in the air only that's it you're never going to meet mama you're never going to get invested in you're never going to get a real commitment from a guy that could actually add value to your life because of this i don't understand this man i pray for any man that got daughters Bro, if you got young daughters, man, the best thing you could do is keep her away from all of these other women, man. You have to. Was it deranged and out of pocket? Maybe. No, God, please, no, no. But was it real as f absolutely? Guys, at this point, we got too many uh points where we gotta really, really, really try to vet these women, right? If they got the bull rings. That's one. If they got an excessive amount of tattoos, that's two. And now we got to add another one to the category, man. And I be reading the comments, but as I actually reflect on my life and I think about the women that I've encountered or even dated or whatever, the ones that had colorful hair were the craziest ones for the most part. Colorful hair. And if they had the trifecta, bull ring, colorful hair, excessive amount of tattoos they are literally and actually serial killers it is what it is man guys i'm telling y'all man we got to teach a master course about this one this one here gonna have to be uh dive deep in this one here we're gonna have to really dive deep on this subject because man i'm starting to see too many trends i got another one butterfly tattoos oh y'all gonna be like nah will you going too far nah man every stripper got a butterfly tattoo all right every only fans girl seem to have a butterfly tattoo every porn star damn near has a butterfly tattoo man i'm sorry that doesn't come off as a coincidence to me we're gonna have to really do some deep studying on this one if you don't believe me bro there's an abundant amount of evidence on tiktok to basically prove my case check this next girl out and check what she's talking about man the lack of morals the lack of self-respect she looks like she's dead on the inside honestly if you look into her eyes watch this huh <sighs> what a great day to be a wow man uh Damn. It just smells like switch him up. That's what it smells like. Switch him up. She looked like she had never seen anything quite so horrible in all her life. Oh, I want to tell you how much you like this. <laughs> I do it for a living. I said, hold up. Wait a minute. Something ain't right. 
<laughs> wait, 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 wait. Wait, what? You rather a guy nut in your mouth or in your face? In my mouth. <laughs> Why you prefer your mouth? Because <laughs> I want to taste it. <laughs> Do you spit or swallow? Swallow. You have to. Let's just, let, let's just look each other in the eyes right quick. Yeah, mm -hmm. like, yeah, like look at me, brother. I'm looking at you. I can see the pain in your eyes. Yeah, it's in my eye, my uh, Five years. Uh, Turn my legs. <laughs> Guys, I might have to start a new series where I find OnlyFans girls and any other girl that's doing stuff that's unsavory and we deep dive into their life and we try to uncover the trauma. All of the childhood stuff that happened to accumulate to where they ended up being the person that they are, man. I think that would be a great great addition to the channel man i'm pretty sure that will get a lot of views as well because we really gonna study the origin stories of how some of these women became the women that they are we have to do it man this for humanity's sake we got to do it man and i might have to be the vessel to create this i might have to be the one so if anyone else does this either i didn't see it happen and that's why i think it's a fresh idea or they stole my idea straight up bro this man really made this a push to start look at this y'all hold up Ski on with no key and man, no, bro. <laughs> hit the gas, hit the gas, man. Hit the gas, man. Hit the I, hear it. I hear it. Hey, man, I really didn't have too much to say about this, but the fact of the matter is, so many talented brothers are in the hood, and especially in my city, New Orleans, man. I feel like we got some of the most talented people who ever walked the face of the earth, man. I promise you I feel that way. I've met some unique individuals from New Orleans, the place that I call home, man, and they just never had an opportunity to use their gifts and explore the world and really become the full potential that they actually had, man. Like, it's sad, actually, but, you know, we come from a poverty-stricken city. Most of my friends didn't even know they daddy. You know what I'm saying? Daddy dead in jail. Or the mama just never knew who the daddy was in the first place. Let's be real. If I'm speaking the truth right now, drop a comment and tell these people I'm telling the truth, man. For real. Me and you were friends? I wanna would you like your wife to have male friends? No, no, no guy friends. Find a guy with a girlfriend that's 300 pounds. Good luck. If me and you were friends, I want to f*** you. I'm going to be nice long enough to stick around while you complain about your boyfriend and give me all the answers to the test. I'm going to do all those perfect things. I don't personally run a game like that because I think that's big. I'm just hypothetically telling you if a guy's sticking around and he wants to be your friend, he wants to sleep with you. Mm-mm. 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 Crazy went through my phone. She's for the dog, I'm doing